and McDonald's CEO Chris has blamed misinformation for its losses as the boycott movement against Western brands continues amid the Israel Hamas war. Kempinski revealed that West Asia sales have been hit by misinformation about the fast food giant's position on the Israel Hamas war. He called such misinformation disheartening and ill-founded. The company in the past had said that it does not take sides in the conflict. He added that McDonald's stands in solidarity with those affected by the war and that it abhors violence and stands against hate speech. He further wrote on LinkedIn and I'm quoting here, in every country we operate, including in Muslim countries, McDonald's is proudly represented by local owners, operators who work tirelessly to serve and support their communities. The boycott Divestment sanctions movement has urged people to reject McDonald's due to its alleged support of the Israeli military. Boycott supporters have shared visuals of McDonald's feeding soldiers after Israel declared war on Hamas in October. The business impact of the boycott, however, remains uncertain. In the last three months of 2023, the company noted a 10.9% sales growth. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.